Ring doorbell. There's Ring and Nest are the two major uh, video doorbell products out there. Uh, I've tried them both. Uh, they do what they say they're going to do. But what's interesting, this is the Ring notice on it. But there's been this doorbell, Generation 2, has been linked to numerous fires throughout the U.S. and Canada. I don't know about Canada so much, but I know in the U.S. Now, Ring has not done a recall on this. They've sent out a notice, and we'll put the link here uh, on the video, uh, saying what the problem is. And it's an interesting problem. So, again, this is not really Ring's problem. What is happening, and I'll pull this apart here, is people are, in it has a little battery pack, and you can chargeable batteries or replace them or whatever. But there's a machine screw that covers the battery pack. Well, what people who have been purchasing this have been doing, uh, instead of the machine screw, they're taking the longer wood screw, screwing it into the housing, and it goes into the batteries. And that's what's causing the short or the heating and is causing the fires. They haven't done a product recall, and I can understand. You can't fix stupid. The people are going to, you know, if you have a machine screw and they throw a wood screw in there, is that really their, their fault that customers are stupid? However, we call it regression towards the mean. Sometimes you gotta design stuff so stupid people can't hurt themselves. So I grabbed this ring video doorbell that is, has the battery pack, and this is the generation two, which they say is the problem. Let's see what we got. Never, haven't unbox, uh, never unboxed this one. This is a uh, brand new. So there is the, the ring. For simple, easy to do. This one is not expensive. I think they're blowing them out the door cheap right now. Uh, it's not an expensive uh, doorbell. It's like under under one hundred fifty dollars. But it's again, it's not a recall. They're just saying. And I've always loved. Uh, they, they come with a nice little kit here. Uh, little, you know, it's got everything in here to install it quite easily. And this is the one for people who don't have, um, you have the battery pack because you don't have the doorbell wires leading to your doorbell. So this is really good with the battery pack uh, for people who don't have the, the wire system to the front door. Here is the little machine screws. So there's one little tiny machine screw, these three other screws. It's well packaged, well you know, well designed. Like under 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 one hundred and fifty dollars. I think they're on sale even less. Yeah, let's warn everybody we have a video. The secret to these things really is they want you on the monthly plan. You can't blame them for that. They want to make money. This is a, a good little kit. Oh, even a little level. Oh my goodness, they got a little bit of everything in here. When you install this, you know, with with the wired system or the unwired, there's two areas they can make a m mistake on. What's happening is they're people are taking the wood screw. And there's, when they put this on the door, instead of, this is how you slow people down from stealing it, you put in the little screws on the bottom. So there's two little machine screws go on the bottom. If you put in the two screws, it slows them down. They have to have a Torx, small Torx. There's two little Torx screws that go in the bottom. Now what's happening is people are either losing these because when you try, you know, you're trying to install this upside down and backwards, you know, upside down on your door, and, and you're going to lose these little screws. You know, it's just a fact of life. You got to drop them. People are, are dropping them, losing them. And what they're doing is taking the longer screw, putting it into the bottom, and they're tightening that, that screw all the way into the battery pack. So, it's not really Ring's fault, so that's why it's there's a warning out to the public from Ring on uh, this problem, and this is basically is just basically people who don't know the difference between a machine screw and a wood screw, and people being stupid and forcing this thing. You really got to crank this to go in there and destroy that lock or destroy the uh, the battery pack. It's a good product. I like their products. They're good. Uh, it's not a, it's not a uh, ring problem. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Subscribe to my channel. Also, visit my website 
and you can see what online locksmith training I have for beginners, intermediate, and advanced, as well as my covert methods of entry and my non-destructive methods of entry.